Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are about to do red lips with neutralize. Now I think red lipstick looks best with neutralize. Now I'm the girl who don't like red lipstick as much, but when I go to college, I see every other girl wearing red lipstick and I'm the one with nude lipstick. So this actually made me try red lipstick. So I've tried red lipsticks a few days back with neutralize and I loved it so much. So this made me to film this video. So yeah, if you want to see how I do my red lips with neutralize and I think it was and it is the best look for daytime and if you're going for a date in day it looks so good i mean it looks flattering and red lips looks flattering and juicy as well so yeah keep watching okay so first i decided to do my eyebrows off camera but i was like i'm just doing my eyes and lips today so why not do brows on camera so it's a brow tutorial as well so i'm gonna do my brows on camera i know they, they look crazy and thin but i'm gonna make it bomb just wait and watch <gasps> okay so for eyebrows i always use this freedom eyebrow pomade in ash brown it suits my hair color well i've used a lot of it as you can see it's actually a good product for thin brows which you can just make it fuller and also if you have full brows but we have little spacing in between so you can fill it with this so yeah i really quite enjoy this product i'm gonna take my spoolie first to just brush up my brows and this is from a dried out mascara I keep looking here because I have my mirror and I can see my face right here so I can just look up here rather than looking at the plants. I'm sorry if I'm not looking. So taking a regular eyebrow brush, regular eyebrow brush, I mean this was from Forever 21 I guess. I use it for my brows because it's thin and I'll just take my color bar makeup setting spray and just sprinkle one or two sprays and it'll become thin like this. <laughs> I know it's bad but can't help it. I'm gonna take this Krylin concealer and this regular concealer brush. I'm gonna take a bit of the product and gonna define. Now this tap is optional but I like how much definition it gives. My baby hair. So I've done same to my other brow too. Ew, what is that? Okay, it's this. Okay, so for my eyes, I'm going to use only one palette, which is by far my favorite. It's from the Makeup Revolution London Fortune Favors Brave Palette. This palette is 
collaborated with British beauty blogger. Now you've got gorgeous shade like the brown. These both right here are my favorite and this peach right here. These three shades I'm going to use today a lot and also this shade for the whole lid. So first I'm going to take this shade right here. I'm going to just dust it all over my lid area. I'm going to do both. I'm going to take this big fluffy brush for the transition shade and this brush is best for blending. I'm going to take this shade and just going to make it my transition color today. I'm going to do the same to my another eye. And this palette is best because it has got mirror which I love our next shade we are gonna take this we are gonna place it above our transition shade to give it a nice warmth I'm gonna take this peach shade with look how much warmth it brings to eyes such a nice shade now taking this brush which I got from this palette as well brush again I'm gonna go with all four shades and just gonna make it our own color I'm just gonna go all the way to it So once we are done blending, now my lids are already powdery but I'm gonna take this shade right here and gonna just rug it here to make it more neutral. Now as I said neutral eyes you can add a little eyeliner into it but I'm not gonna wear any eyeliner because I don't feel like so going in with my Rimmel Volume Flash Scandalize Mascara. I love this mascara so much. First I'm gonna just take my eyelash curler and just gonna because they are so straight. I'm gonna do the same to my Okay. Okay, I know I look crazy when I just see into the camera and you guys will be scared to death. I'm I'm just gonna take my mirror I'm just gonna apply mascara. Now I love this mascara so much. This is just one coat of it and we can go out with this but I like to apply two to three coats of this mascara. Two to three coats are enough because it will make your lashes clumpy if you 
go all over the board so two to three are enough actually two are enough you can't really go for three because it'll clump up your lashes mm -hmm. see how much difference it makes i'm gonna do the same two coats on this side Same with those candlelights and mascara, but it will be the same to our long lashes. So for red lipstick, I'm going to use Maybelline New York Lip Gradation in red 1. Now, red lipstick can be a pain in the ass because you have to be very careful while you apply it. If you get it down, like down your lips, you can just take a little concealer brush and you can brush a, a bit. And I'm done. So this was a simple simple makeup tutorial of neutral eyes with red juicy lips i hope you guys enjoy it if you like this look or if you love red lipstick please like this video subscribe my channel viewers thank you for viewing me if you're saying thank you have a good day and yeah bye